Hi everyone, it's Frank Gahi with VMAX Omega here in Irvine, California. And thank you for watching my video blog. I've received a few phone calls recently asking me about the accuracy and the reliability of Zillow's home value estimates or Zestimates. So today we're going to talk about Zestimates. Before I start, I want to draw your attention to the two links on this page. Uh, if you click on the home value report, you can receive a free market evaluation on your home. If you're looking for a home or an investment property, you can click on the home search link and you have access to all the properties currently on the market. Let's go back to our topic. Are the Zestimates accurate and reliable? I'm often asked by my clients if they could base their offer on a particular property on the Zestimate value or if the Zestimate value is what their property should sell for if you case they're thinking of selling. In my opinion, Zestimates are not accurate and they're not reliable. Here's why. If you're looking at the particular Zestimate and if you scroll down all the way to the bottom of the page and click on Zestimate, uh, it will take you to a page that explains how they arrived at that valuation. For example, for Irvine, if you click on the Zestimate, it will show that they have put all the data from Los Angeles, Long Beach, and as they put it, Anaheim, and through a certain algorithm, they will calculate the home values in Irvine. And we know uh, that that is not a reflective of the values in Irvine. Here are the drawbacks, actually. From the buyer's standpoint, considering to put an offer on the property, if the property is listed, let's say, at 750,000, and the Zestimate is at 700,000, the question is, is the Zestimate undervalued or is, is the property overpriced? From the seller's standpoint, on the same property, uh, if the Zestimate value is at $700,000 and based on a professional opinion, the market value of the property is at $750,000. But the buyers, because of the Zestimate value of $700,000, are basing their offer based on the $700,000, you will see how it would adversely impact the sellers. In my opinion, if you want to find out the true market value of your home, you need to contact a trusted professional in your area, one with experience and proven record to provide you with the market evaluation on your home. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, if you click on the home value report, I would be more than happy to provide you with a free market evaluation on your home if you are thinking of selling. I want to thank all of you who send in such kind emails uh, in regard to this video series. If there is any topics on your mind that you would like me to address in my future videos, please call me or email me. And remember, who you work with matters.